Good morning, people. Well, it's morning for us. I don't know if it's morning for you guys. It's probably going to be evening or afternoon, or it could be morning, but just in case. We are off to Chester. Chester. Kids, as well. Which is Kids are back at school. Yesterday they had um, Monday off because it was May Day, 1st of May. So yeah. they wasn't at school for that. Uh, so we went out and did a bit of shopping with the kids, got them some. Actually, I'll show you what we got them, actually. Just unlock right. this door. Right, Lorenzo, obviously, as you know, football mad. So his choice was these little mini goals. Um, we got them from Decathlon, I think they was like £14 bargain. What it is is because we don't really, well, I don't really allow ball in the house. I do. Whereas he does anywhere. Listen, listen. If you want to get better at football, yeah, or you want your kids to get better at football, allow football in the house. I allow, I've allowed it all, all, all the years. We've been, they've been playing football for the last like, what? They've been playing for the last like seven years in the house. So, why change it now? My, my side of the story is, I don't mind them playing in the house, just certain areas of the house. Like, as we move into the new house, we have lots of space. But I don't want ball everywhere. So I said like, no ball in the living room. Conservatory, dining room, fine, but not the living room. And the main place I want to play football is in the living room and I don't see why. Like people sit down there to watch telly and stuff. Don't want them to be kicking ball up and down. Plus, they kick the ball kind of hard, breaking in my ornaments or anything like that, or hit the telly or anything. Then, do you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm gonna be like, yeah. I brought this ball, this one. It's like a really soft, fly away kind of ball, it was like three pounds. Purely for the fact that I know it's gonna end up in the living room, I know it. So yeah, if it does. Yeah, we had a um, craft bar challenge yesterday in the living room when you wasn't there, you went out to the shops. We had a craft bar challenge and a woodwork challenge. Absolutely insane, yeah. The power I can get on that board in the living room is absolutely immense. And because the living room's so long as well, it feels like you're playing on a full size pitch. It really, really, really is good. <laughs> See, I don't understand why in the conservatory of all this space, and then you've also got in the in the dining room area all that space. Why that's not enough to keep balling? But Sienna, I'll show you what Sienna got. Now I think every household, well, if you've got kids, uh, young or even teenagers, I think every house should have one. Now we got this from Decathlon also. It was really cheap. I think it was like twenty pounds. It's one of these guys. Now we used to know it as. Swing ball, I think we used to call it swing ball. Um, obviously, ball on a string, and obviously, you can bat it round, it comes with bats. I think it's an absolutely amazing thing because it's hand eye coordination, it helps build your hand eye coordination. The kids have spent at least what in total about two hours on this since yesterday evening. Me and Nathan have had a go, it's for all ages, it gets them outside, they're having fun. The exercising without realising it and it was a bargain it's 20 pounds i know you can get them from argos and everywhere else but i think this one from decathlon is really good because it hasn't got the um there's a, usually something come there and you have to go the ball has to go all the way around and down on a string and it can get tied and knotted whereas this just swings around on the top you stick water in the bottom there and you're good to go uh so this is what sienna picked up because she really likes tennis and stuff um and she also likes boxing and i think without realizing this helps her move like movement and her arms and stuff so yeah good goodbye love that um sarah got a twin bunk bed for her babies as you know she's a proper girly girl so she got that what did ramona pick anything um did it no, did it i don't think it is why didn't it i'm not getting why I think we Oh, all... that's what it was, because we went to JD yesterday and he picked up the trainers, them Jordans, with mm. the diamond size, screw it. So we'll try and get them for him today, as he's, even though he's, his gifts tend to be the most expensive ones without realising it. Mm. I think it's because he doesn't get as many things as the little kids do, because we'll go out to toy shops and they'll see things that they want, things that are like 10, 15, 20 pounds, 30 pounds. They'll see them and we'll go, yeah, that's fine. Whereas Romello, he's always mm, um and ah mm. He ums and ahs about so many things, like Romello picks something, I don't know, have a look somewhere else, and then we'll come home and he won't have anything. But, and then he's also on the other side, he's really compulsive. Like we went to JD the other day, yesterday, and he picked up a pair of trainers and straight away he wanted them. He didn't look around, 
He didn't look at any of the trainers. Yeah, yeah. He picked it up and straight away wanted it. Whether that's a good or bad thing, I don't know. Obviously, it could be a good thing because he's in and out of the shop straight away. Or a bad thing that he just impulse buys. Either way, anyway. Say hello. Say hello, Beads. Come on. Come on, Beads. I'm always have to come to you to give you a rub on your tummy. Not your Beads. Say hi to everybody, Beads. Look at this lazy boy. Lazy boy on his little rug outside his little bed. Ooh. Gosh, we continue with this this diet thing. This diet thing is killing me. Do you know what I mean? To be honest, I think we've done we've done all right in it with the diet. Yeah, well, I think the meal prep helped. Yeah, we, we've done like a meal prep. So like, there's these small containers here, basically. And uh, what is it? There we've been having meat. That we've been having like carbs. So I've been having like rice, and that's been veg. I really think I think that should be veg. That should be meat. That should be carb. You can do it how you feel to do, really. Yeah, it's true. But we're continuing that today. Yeah. Um, oh, that's Sophie. You, you really see, have you seen Sophie before? Yeah. Oh, they have seen Sophie. They're yeah. Sophie. Sophie, the last Sophie time. rarely, rarely comes downstairs. Psst, psst. Looks like the cat don't like me. Look. Oh, I'm scared. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, Sophie. See, oh, she's moving away. The cat. It's not my biggest fan. I'm not the biggest fan's cat either. But anyway, as I was saying, today uh, we're going to continue with the diet and I'm going to have something sensible, which is going to be a banana this morning, which is going to be all right. Then I'm going to go to the fridge and I'm going to have uh, oh, a banana for me. Drink water. I'm just going to have water. Oh, God, it's so boring. So boring. Water is. Don't you think so? No, I like water. I always drink water anyway. Oh, God. Um, I picked this up the other day. It's a bio um, skinny water flavoured. Skinny that, water? No, it's blackcurrant like, flavour. Listen, they're no, tricking wait, you. Can I finish? No, no, let me just say something quickly. Yeah, this skinny water yeah, is the same as having water, which I have, and green top. What's the difference? Difference is it's clear, so it's just water, okay. it's just flavourings. It's got zero sugar, zero calories, and it's natural flavours. It also has, I don't know if this one has it. Some of them have vitamins in. <laughs> There's a raspberry one and a couple of other ones, and they have vitamin in, vitamins in the water. So if you're not getting enough vitamins through your food, if you're dieting, then you can drink one of these and you get your vitamins. And, and can I ask how much that was? A pound. Oh, fair not enough. Not too bad. But how much, how much are these? Uh, these were, were they 18 or 24? Costco, half price, two pound, three pound 70. Okay, three pound 70 for 24. You spent one pound on that. That, as I said, is how much? 24 for what? 370. 370. And how much is a bottle of, of drink? Uh, that is full sugar. Okay, how much is it? That is full sugar. How much is the thing you want? Uh, two pounds. Two pounds, okay. So, does that make sense then? Yeah, it does because that's full sugar. That's not being so sugar free. Hence the reason you'll be drinking a lot of sugar in that. Yeah, but so, sugar free one. How much is it? Is it the same price as that? Because I'm sorry, it is. It can be, but so, it don't, it's not the same. Leave me alone with my skinny water. Yeah. You, you carry on with your skinny water. Let me trick you. I ain't being tricked because I brought one. If I was being tricked, I would have brought about 20. Why is that cat standing around anyway? She wants more food. Even though I fed her this morning. Right then, so we are heading out the door right now. I managed to get him right. I'll just quickly show you. I go through Hoovers like no one's business, like really, really quickly. Like I think every six months I end up buying a new Hoover. Um, we always have had Vax. Um, and I'm not gonna lie, the reason why I've always had Vax is because every time I've gone to buy them, they've been half price. What are you gonna do? Do you know what I mean? You're gonna get like a 300 pound Hoover for like 120 pounds, if not less, so less than half price. And I said to Nathan, I said, I want a Dyson, I want a Dyson Hoover. Um, so he was like, okay, we'll go buy one. And then I seen this one. Let me get it. This one here, the ones that have the cordless, and it comes with two heads and accessories. And I absolutely love it. If you've been considering getting one, but you're thinking, mm mm, should I, should I? Because that's what I was like at first, like, is it going to have enough suction? Is it going to be mm, perfect? Love it. Even Nathan loves it. Clean the car, you said, didn't you, Nathan? Know, what? Well, the Hoover? The Hoover. Yeah, it's called Hoover. Yeah. I don't think I don't like about the Hoover. Yeah, you're going to think I'm moaning again. The only thing I don't like about the Hoover is it lasts 20 minutes. Is that stupid? 
It's not stupid because you can get ones that last 40 minutes. It just yeah, depends. Yeah, but how much is that? Like £400. Pounds. What's the point? You might have to buy a cord if you I don't want the cord on the Hoover, that's the whole point. I'm the one that has to lug it all the way up the stairs, plug it out about six different times to go into like four different rooms. He never hoovers. Oh, nice. he... Do you hear this? Oh, I've done it in my whole life. He never hoovers. He hard. You yeah, never hardly hoovers, he hardly washes up, he hardly does laundry. I don't even know if you know how to start the washing machine. He's pampered, you know. This guy's fully pampered. His mum pampered him up until he left home. His mum used to pamper him all the time, always getting spoiled. He was always spoiled. Were you not spoiled? Were you not spoiled? That's all. If I phone your mum now and ask your mum, was Nathan sport when he was a kid, what would she say? I feel to find him because I'm holiday. Oh, I'm not going to disturb him exactly. because I'm holiday. You got no proof. He was spoiled. Oh. I, that's all, all your brothers. I know Wayne. Wayne is watching this, right? Wayne, comment down below if Nathan was spoiled when he was younger. He was spoiled because he was the youngest. And I know Jason watches the videos too. So, Jace, got my back. Yeah? <laughs> spoiled. The thing is, yeah, I can't even say it because I'm the youngest out of my siblings and I was spoiled too. So anyway, we're gonna hop into the hoopty. Nathan, you've left the window down. Yep. Oh, 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 let me get my bean. Let me get my beans. For the grass. I've already got my this normal bean. See? I do everything. Even cut the beans, put the beans back. Go on in, you're right. And yeah. <laughs> the recycling bin. Let's go. Right, so we are about not far at 23 all. miles from our destination. Uh, we've been driving for about an hour ish, give or take. Yeah, we just stopped and got some Starbucks on the way. Um, well, I was going to say, I did. Put it on to say something that I can't remember what I'm saying. What do you think of Nathan's glasses? Hey, these glasses are sick, you know, honestly. These glasses are what, what are they from, Nathan? They're from the Kaplan. Yeah. What did the tell them? I was going to tell them to Prada. <laughs> <laughs> if you have watched the, our channel for quite a while, you will know that these glasses are from the Kaplan and they're his bike riding glasses, <laughs> right? He's more and more in the car than he has on the bike, listen, let's listen, just say listen, that. Listen. They was just in the car, what it was, yeah. We've, we have, we've still kind of moving house, we haven't moved anything yet. So like, the bike's still at the old house. So before I've actually bought the bike, I thought I'd bring the glasses. I don't know why. So the, <laughs> the glasses are just sitting down there. So I thought, you know what? The sun's in my eyes. Why not put a good two pound worth of glasses? <laughs> Honestly, right? The bikes, wow. Well, my bike was free because my bike was from uh, Birmingham City Council. They had like a scheme going on and I joined up to the scheme and they gave me a free brand new bike. Yeah. It's not a good bike though. That's garbage, man. It's not that bad of a bike. It's so hard. It's, yeah. There's no suspension on the bike. It's a decent bike. You can go around on it. You can do exercise on it. It's a good bike. Just about. It's we we <laughs> brought this guy that bike. I don't know if you've seen it. You would have seen it, wouldn't they? Yeah, they've seen the yeah, bike. You've seen the bike. Seen it, yeah. We brought that bike. What was it? Four hundred pounds. Something like that. Yeah. Good bike. Three times. Three times. He's with that bike. Like about three or four times max. Yeah. yeah. So. No. Oh, to be max now, listen, I should ride it down to be honest. Obviously at first I was doing a bit a lot more riding. The weather started to get really, really bad. Do you know what I mean? You went on for the bike rides and stuff, so obviously I didn't have a lot to, to go with. That was when I had a bad back, wasn't it? And I couldn't yeah, ride yeah. the bike. Every time we're looking to lose weight, yeah, and you need to exercise, you always got a bad back. Phantom things happen to me. Not even like I don't go out of my way to get injured, but like as soon as we say, right, we're gonna go this, gonna do that. All of a sudden, like, I have a read of my back, or my knee will start hurting. It's like my body's going, no, do not exercise, no. But yeah, um, we need to bring the bikes around, actually. Um, we went to Toys R Us yesterday, and the twin bar, twins, Soraya, see the bike, and they had like a baby carry chair on the front of it. So she wants that bike now. They do need new bikes, because now they, well, now, they've been able to ride with no stabilizers for ages now, haven't they? Yeah. And their other bikes are quite small, so they need like, I think it's like a 12, 14 inch bike now, or 12 inch bike. And they seen one and I said, so do you like that bike? So their birthdays are coming up soon. It's next month already, it's next month. Like, yeah, yeah the 6th, no, no, 6th, the 9th of June. June. The 9th of June, 
So I'm thinking that they could probably have some new bikes. They were going to get them this like a Wendy house, but like a one that has, I think, a space underneath so they can park their cars and stuff. Might they get them, get them another thingy car, yeah. electric yeah, car? Another, yeah, another one. They have a beetle, but it's been left in the garden, and yeah. it is like a swimming pool. I went in there. There's so many spiders in there. Uh, no. Oh. Do you know what? Then again, it probably could jet wash out. It could clean up, but we'll probably clean it and put it to take it to the charity shop or something. Because yeah, yeah. they could do an upgrade, like a two seater one or something. We are arriving at our destination. I feel like we should have got off because <laughs> we like we're missing it. Did we miss the exit? I don't know. I think this. Uh, no, I think this is the way you get into it. It's what the sat nav's saying. I don't trust this sat nav. I swear, at all whatsoever. Finally here. Cheshire, I was saying Chester earlier. Yeah, it's it's Cheshire, Cheshire Oaks. Cheshire Oaks. So not far from Manchester. Got some good shops, some like high end, and then also some middle end yeah. shops as well. You've got like your yeah, low end anyway. G Star. Yeah. <laughs> no, there's no Primark <laughs> knife. Um, you got your G Star. You got your Levi's. You got your Gap Outlet. You've got Guess. You got Coast. You've got um, Ugg. You got Ralph Lauren. You got Ralph Lauren. Um, they got a good couple of places. I think there's like over a hundred. There's like a hundred um, outlet stores no, here. No, there's like, Adidas. There's Tommy Hill. Wait, what should we do to go to the um, Just or? just park in here, and there's got to be toilets around. Why do, you, why do I need a toilet like this? Me too. See me. I can hold a toilet for like four or five days. He says this every single uh, time, <laughs> but he never can. I actually oh, can. Yeah. I can hold the toilet for ages. You know, these days, it's like I'm getting old, man. I can't. I need to go to the toilet. It's ridiculous. There's got to be some sort of thing here. There's got to be, because I just have to get out and there's a bush out there, isn't it? Oh, you got us. <laughs> right, I'm out in my two pound glasses, killing it. Do you know what? I've got two pound glasses on, but I feel like a flipping millionaire. Okay. <laughs> the thing is, yeah, I'm not going to lie to you. Right. I've seen a couple of geezers before. Yeah. Yeah. And they look like actually hobos. Yeah, they hop into like yeah. flipping 80 grand cars. And this so is the thing. It's the way, just the way, way the world's going. The people, people that have the most money, yeah, look like tramps, man. I think that's how it is. If you're not, unless you're a footballer or like yeah, I know, yeah. They always want to look flashy and that, don't they? But listen, I'm thinking that I'm gonna start wearing trampy clothes. To be honest, oh, do you yeah. know what I mean? <laughs> So, we've been chopping for about half an hour. 45 minutes. 45 minutes? Yeah. I haven't got nothing. One bag. I haven't even seen one thing. You've got Make one up. bag. That's it. I haven't even seen anything that I feel like buying. You have. You know, this is like just going Soul to the trailer. gym. It's like I'm doing walking and exercise, yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? But I'm actually buying anything. I think it is a, there's loads more shops still. There's loads of shops here. Yeah, we've hardly like, touched on any of the shops to be honest. Yeah. We've hardly been. Yeah. Like, all Saints coming up now, so we're looking there. So, yeah, we're going to shop a bit more. And and obviously, Joshua. Where? Oh. Oh, you think he was actually there? Oh, yeah, no, no, you're really talking like he's actually there. Yeah, if you're buying anything, then we'll let you know, innit? Right then, as we walk across the road, the shelves get a little bit better. So, Ralph Lauren's there. Look at the size of this Ralph Lauren as well. Absolutely huge. Polo Ralph Lauren, though, innit? Yeah, but it don't matter. It's Ralph Lauren, nevertheless. Yeah, but it's, it's polo huge. Ralph I can see like bus over there. I don't think people can see coach and that. There's loads of shops, loads of shops down there. But so, I don't reckon I'm going to buy anything. We're going to go with Ralph Lauren or not? For the kids, yeah. For the kids. I don't really shop in here, but the oh. kids, the kids' clothes. Let's have a look then. Just come out of uh, Polo Ralph Lauren. And I think same as when we went to Bista the other day. It's just the same stuff, more or less. So unless we go to a shop which we haven't been into when we went to Bista, we're going to come across the same stuff. Sometimes we've got more because obviously the shop is bigger. But if the shop's the same size, then we're probably going to end up looking at the exact same stuff as we did on Saturday. So, Rafflin was a fail. Um, we're going to try. Oh, Kurt Gogger over there. I didn't go into that when we went to Bista. And I want to get some footwear, so we'll check back in if I actually purchase anything. But until then, catch you in a bit. Finally, I went to get these from the one at Bista. And there was two odd colours. Could oh, you yeah. believe it? It's a high plan, honestly. They were two odd colours and I finally got them. I feel excited. I would have actually come all the way for these. Just for these. Yeah. Right, now 
Let's see if I can find any more. No, no more. Yeah, I'm done. I'm ready now to eat. Right then, so we're at Wadamama's. That's the Asian place to eat, literally. Yeah. I had to pick somewhere to eat like, every day. I thought I'd pick this like most of the most of the really? time. Yeah, you got something you're having it? I'm having the duck wraps, so the duck pancakes and the yaki soba um, chicken and corn. Yeah. It's come from the order. You got it? Then I get um, a 116, yeah. um, 103, yeah. um, sorry, sorry. 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 <laughs> Uh, 71. Uh, no, that's four. Chicken katsu. Yeah. And then can I get a 40 with no uh, ginger food? Anything else you see? No, that's it, thank you. So we've got um, pancakes and then katsu. Yep. Katsu for in the apple, so chicken for no ginger. Yeah, great. I'll see if you can just grant us one tray, guys. Yeah, yeah. That's that's cool. Cool. Take too long for us with you, okay? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, can't wait. Let's see who comes up first. Mmm, some of the starters come out. It looks so nice, this does. What's this called again? Uh, you, know, you know the technical names of all these? Yebi something, Yebi cactus, something like that. How nice does that look, man? Them prawns look so crispy. Yeah. And you're still waiting on yours. It's a starter, man. <laughs> Hold on, what about your business? My starter is here. I almost started to eat without showing you. Nathan reminded me I need to show you what I had. So I've had a duck of pancakes. So it doesn't look as crispy as it usually is, but I'll eat it the same way. So my main meal has come out. So I've not only got the prawns, I've got this capsule curry as well, which looks absolutely amazing. I cannot wait to eat this. So guys, I'm showing it up and my food has come out before yours. <laughs> food is here. I'll show you. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, it'll yeah, do. Um, I'm kind of used to my wagon almost back in Birmingham. It's not as it's not as cooked enough, it's not done enough how I like it, but it will do because pizzas were you know like we do back in now we so right guys we have left well we left about what? 45 minutes ago. We left about 45 minutes ago. We are probably about an hour and a half. No, hour and a half. 30, 40, 30 minutes to 45 minutes away from home. Uh, shouldn't take too long. Surprise, surprise actually, because the kids don't finish till five o'clock today. That's why we came on the Tuesday, go knowing that we had to go all the way past Manchester. They would have enough time to spend there and come back. So we're going to get back probably in time to pick them up if it was normal time. So we are on our way home. Um, we are, what we got to do when we get back? Uh, uh, finish up this, I've got editing. Finish the blog. Nothing's going on really, except for it is Champions League and Real Madrid are playing Athens Comedy tonight. So I'll watch that. So I'm gonna try and edit this before that. And then chill for the rest of the Oh, yeah. Didn't really get anything else after. We got, I got the Uggs, got the twins some, Mark Paws, uh, little trainery things. If you follow um, the Meet the Greers on Instagram, I'll put pictures up on there so you can check out what we actually got. I got some other little bits, not a major. Nathan didn't get anything. Nothing at all. I was gonna buy a Nintendo Switch for them, not in it. But I went in, very enthusiastic about buying one. I came out, I could just like the funeral. It's 300 pound. Uh, it's 300 pound? Yeah, 300 pound. Yeah, and then you get this 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 flipping control pad thing. It's split into two, and then like then it's two control pads, and then to buy another two control pads, it's seventy-two pound extra. And then you gotta buy a Mario Kart because what's the point of a Nintendo Switch without Mario Kart? You gotta buy that as well. So that's fifty pound as well. So if I was to buy that, I wouldn't spend like four hundred and thirty pound today. When you say it like that, it don't seem worth it. Right guys, we are home. The kids have been picked up. They're in their pyjamas, ready for bed. They've had their dinner. Um, me and Nathan haven't had IG yet. Um, I'm just sitting down watching EastEnders. Right. <laughs> what did you do in school today? I, oh, me, me, me. We learned about awesome for our lesson. Yeah. Get complete. So I now please. I want to be a lion king. I better be the cake. Me, Mom. Hey, 
So that's not nice. So they're doing a Lion King dance and song at school. I'm assuming after the past couple of days, and, 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 and we're and we're doing that. And we no, we isn't it? We have our new writing, isn't it? Oh yeah. 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 And, and oh, oh, I forgot the bit. Okay. Stop talking. I'm sorry. It hurts. I came into Diddy's and went into Changes. Yes, they've gone from dinners to sandwiches, which they've been wanting to do for ages. So we finally done it at the beginning of last week when they went back after the holidays. So they have sandwiches now. But I've got my um, my uh, new purchase on. They are so comfortable. They are lovely. And look, I'm going, I'm going. My tooth came out. Oh, my yeah. Mum, I out. Her tooth came out. Mum, I don't want Oh, God. Oh, we got yeah, some. Got for tea coming Should we let? Should I show you the money? Come here, come here. Uh, what can I say again? <laughs> oh, 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 Put in my pillow and see it has a tea fairy, there's a tea fairy coming and then she she went when I was sleeping when I wanted to see She only comes then. when you're sleeping, she doesn't come when you're awake. Well it's a load of computers so I can see anybody oh Did you see her? Yeah. yeah. She has she long hair. hair. Does she? Yeah. I wanna see Santa, Santa now. Oh Bob Christmas is coming to the end of the year. Hey. Right. Girls, let's end the vlog here. Say goodbye and good night to everybody. Come on. Say goodbye. Goodbye. And good night. I hope you have a great day, Yay. great week, great month, great year. Take it easy and rest up. Catch rest you soon. Bye. 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 Bye.